Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. So you can see today's topic is best position for lapping in shear walls. This was a question asked by a student. So I wanted to explain it for you people so that you may not face the lapping position if you are a designer or if you are a civil structure engineer. Okay, uh, so today's topic is the best position for lapping in shear walls. First, you shall know the purpose of a shear wall that why do we use shear walls in a structure. So you must know that uh, whenever you are going for high rise buildings, now different stories, we provide a wall, okay. The purpose of this wall is to resist loads from this direction, okay. Shear wall has nothing to do with gravity loads. You must know that shear wall has nothing to do with gravity loads. It always has to face loads from lateral direction. Now, you must know that the, so the shear force diagram of shear wall will be somewhat like this. Okay, so at this point, the wall will face maximum shear and at this point the wall will face minimum shear okay uh, now you all know that at maximum shear point at maximum bending point you cannot provide lap in any structure okay that is the general phenomena of any type of structure so here it will face the uh, bending moment here it will face the shear uh, maximum shear so we can say that this region where it will be uh, facing the middle shear and middle moment we will provide the lap because lap is ultimately a weak point so the weak point shall be provided at a point where the structure is not facing either maximum bending moment either maximum shear okay so uh, this is the good point uh, this is the best position where you shall provide the lapping in a shear wall so the structure may get and yes your one thing is very much important the lap shall be alternate okay alternate means if you are like if if, if this is the uh, elevation of any shear wall then lap shall be somewhat like this okay if you are lapping it here it will be lapped here it will be left here it will be left here so that the phenomena of weakening the face of the shear wall will be reduced although it has to face loads from this direction okay from this direction not from face it will be uh, facing load from this direction so this is how you can control the uh, weakening of the shear wall and uh, the lateral uh, movement of the high rise building so this was a short video about bridge slapping zone for shear walls i hope you would have learned something uh, you can ask your questions in comments thank you